I'm Noelle Madison with Healthy Places blog Living with Adult ADHD and I wanted to talk about perseveration which is not to be confused with perseverance. So I'm going to read a couple definitions. According to the Merriam-Webster dictionary, perseverance is, quote, continued effort to do or achieve something despite difficulties, failure, or opposition. While perseveration is, quote, continuation of something, such as rep repetition of a word, usually to an exceptional degree or beyond a desired point. So they both come from the same root, but one of them is considered positive and the other is considered negative. It seems as though their main difference is based on their effectiveness. And perseveration came centuries, or the definition at least, came centuries after perseverance. And it's a psychological term that was invented in the early 1900s. So a lot of people can have perseveration or exhibit signs of perseveration, not just people with ADHD, but also people with obsessive compulsive disorder, with autism, or with schizophrenia. Some symptoms of that, obviously one of the most blatant signs is repeating words and phrases over and over again, but for people with ADHD, it primarily comes in the inability to stop talking about something or stop doing something or stop feeling something. People can feel emotionally or intellectually stuck on something that they're really into or that they really hate. And that can make people very rigid and unable to change their schedule or to do something that somebody asks them to do. Um, this can also be exacerbated by anxiety. So, I'm not quite sure if there's a difference between hyperfocus and perseveration because some psychologists think there is no such thing as um, hyperfocus hyper for people with ADHD, whereas others think that there is. To me, they are slightly different because you might hyperfocus on something, which just means, ex you know, focus really intensely for a long time on something because you love it so much, whereas you might not be able to move from one activity to another because of the sense of perseveration. They certainly feed into each other, but they're not exactly the same thing. So I was wondering what you think and if you feel this urge to stick to the same topic and talk about something you love or hate for ages and what you do to deal with that. So thanks for checking the video out and let me know what you think in the comments.